Hello and welcome back again, my friend, to the SP500 index analysis, the Nasdaq 100 analysis, and the DXY analysis plus the Bitcoin price prediction. This is Thomas with you again, guys. We came back in another video. So, as you see, guys, here, there is nothing new here. We're still waiting the Fed decision, what they are going to tell us. Tell now there is nothing new. And the Fed decision is going to come at 7 o'clock GMT time. Then you change it to your local time. Then after that, by 30 minutes, it's going to come the press conference of uh, Jerome Powell of the Fed. So tell now, guys, there is nothing new here. We still have here that triangle. Tell now it hasn't been broken. So it needs the market to break it either up or either down. And tell now there is nothing new and how is going to break it guys it's need a candle to start here and to close above that level here that's how it's going to be broken tell now there is nothing new here also we still sideways and we're still in a very very stronger level as you see it so there is nothing new guys and even in the daily if we go here you change it from four hours to daily like that as you see it guys when we change it from 4 hours to daily, we still here at the 200 moving average and the 200 moving average being reacting like a very stronger resistance. So either we're going to break it up and that here is going to be the bottom. How is going to be the bottom guys? As you see it, he gave us here a big double bottom. So if we came and we break in that level here, that's something extra. But till now, us we still here in the 4 hours. Here in the 4 hours guys, us here we are above the 200 moving moving average but as you see it here it's being above the 200 moving average then after that it's falling down so let's wait what's going to happen and let's see from here it's going to give us a head and shoulder if it give it to us that's going to be something extra because as you see i'm not drawing top of it now also we came here above if it came down here it's going to give us a head and shoulder so we need to wait a little bit guys and here guys we still have here that up channel like that as you see it it hasn't been changed yet so us we still in an up trend here and uh, all the traders now they waiting the fed meeting or the fed interest rate what they are going to tell us so tell now there is nothing new guys everything is too clear guys let's see our indicators were the same for pictures to be more clear to you our indicator guys as you see it, it's still here at the overbought area level we are in a very stronger level i'll show it to you as you see it price action we got is that up channel here it need to be broken down here for us to enter short tell now there is nothing clear so we need to wait in more and for long it's need to break that one here as i show it to you the triangle here it's need the market to came to break up here that man is going to go more higher than that till now there is nothing new guys also we need to wait in a little bit maybe tomorrow we will find another direction or a new direction everything is too clear by the way you yes you are you not yet subscriber make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn the bell notification on to receive all our latest updates and videos also guys every day we put in for you two videos every day two videos so like that you're going to be very 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 well updated about what the market doing right now and if you want to be notified more quicker you can join us in telegram the link of our telegram is it in the first comment because in telegram you're going to be notified more quicker than here in youtube you done it welcome to the family my friend now guys let's go in to see the nasdaq 100 what they doing today so it's going there here it is the nasdaq guys as you see the nasdaq here same thing like the sp500 we still have here the triangle so there is nothing new here so we need to wait in the same thing either to break up or either to break down because all of them they are correlated to each other guys so here there is nothing new you can just make something like that it's like a small wage like that and you wait it if it's going to break down it's going to fall down down till here so us we still in a very 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 criteria place guys there is nothing new now so we need to wait in what's going to happen and as i told you all the people now they're looking at the fed meeting what they are going to do so here nothing new also we still here in the 200 moving average and we couldn't break it as you see it that the chart time first here second here and now we are at the chart time so we're going to see either we're going to break it up or we're going to go back down because as you see guys here if you came like that and you do it like that it try to give you here like a small flag like that can even make that one as a flag like that now we need to wait it either it's going to break higher or no tell now also we are in a resting level as you see it it's been here for some time 
so we need to know where it's going to break either up if it's breaking up we bring in that line here and we will put it like that so if it's breaking up it's going to go till here or that peak here as you see it as you see it from here and here that's if it's breaking up guys so tell now as we stay sideways there is nothing new here let's see our indicators guys what the same for picture to be more clear to you our indicator guys as you see it it's still here at the overbought area level we are in a very stronger level but there is no price action there indicating for us as we need to enter short the only price action we have there is that wage like that as i show it to you as you see it guys it's need that one to come and to break down here for us to enter short if we enter short it's going to be tell here the tech profit so tell now there is nothing new guys we need to wait in a little bit after the fed the um, interest rate decision we're going to know what's going to happen tell now everyone is waiting now let's go into the dxy guys to see what the uh, us dollar index doing today so let's go in there the US dollar guys as you see it as we are here in a very very sharp down channel so maybe that one is good to go down to touch the lower here but just a scenario and here as you see here in that place now what it done for us it's breaking for us that support and that support now here it's been reacting like a resistance because if you see it here it came down here then it go back here now it's falling more what that let me explain it to you here we got here a support the market it came here and break it like that then it go back it touches here now we are here now if we break in that last low which is here that one here you're going to know it is going to fall down guys tell now we haven't break it and we still wait in there because if we zoom it like that let's zoom it and we see it together if you see in here guys that the last low which is here and that one here it came up what it touched then support being broken it being reacting like a resistance now it's falling down they need to break for us that last peak here for us to know is going to continue down everything is too clear guys so here there is nothing new and also we are very very down in the 200 moving average as you see it and we are in a very sharp downtrend guys so the, the us dollar index it's indicating the market is going to fall down but let's wait in the news because even the news is can all that it came out and you're going to see another change in the direction so tell now there is nothing new guys and our indicator let's see it our indicator it's still here at the oversold area and it's taken very 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 long that way me i told you guys if there is no price action there is no entry and as you see it how long it's pending here at the oversold area as you see it from here look tell where we are and also we are in a very very sharp downtrend look at it that way me I told you those escalators don't need to base your trading on them and everything is in front of you guys i think everything is too clear here now let's go into see the bitcoin what it's doing in four hours with pictures to be more clear to you here we are guys in the bitcoin the bitcoin as you see it it give us a new high now and we are here at that level where we are now here guys here exactly as you see it we are there we are now at 18095 as you see that's a new high guys and that's something very 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 good but now if you want to enter short you need to look in as i told you that one the only price action you have here and that one the up channel you are in the top of it now here now let's see if we are going to break higher here that's when we are going to continue it upwards guys and here what me i told you here when we draw in that flag we used to have here we used to have here a flag guys and we make it like that the take profit of it when it's breaking it bring you exactly the take profit guys as you see it it bring you exactly the take profit guys exactly actually also we're making that flag from here like that and like that guys and we make it like that and like that the place where it's breaking we put in that one bringing that line here and we put it here it bring you exactly exactly the tech profit that the power of technical analysis guys you see it or no we bring in that line here and we put it here it bring it to you exactly that's when we have been telling you when it's being sideways here we need to wait in and now it's breaking upward as you see it, it's bringing the target exactly guys everything is very simple guys and all people they will enter with us for that about three weeks i think we enter from here why we enter from there because we used to have there a triangle and what we said about the tech profit we came we do it like that then in the place where it's breaking we make it like that yes or no where we said tech profit is going to be here at that level did it bring it guys look at it should you take now the profit no my friend don't take the profit don't take profit now 
suppose we enter from here it came here i told you protect yourself at man if you buy 100 dollar from here over here you're going to sell what it equal your 100 dollar you're going to left with some bitcoin here now look tell where you are here now what should you do that profit you left with you need to sell some of it by the way that money management strategy me i'm telling you it's very 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 well explained in our crypto investing course the course is it in the first comment if you're using the couple link down it will not cost you that much it will cost you only 13 bucks the course believe me is better than million of courses online they sell it to you by one thousand and two thousand dollars because that course is show you how to buy and how to sell why majority of people they losing the money not because of the trading strategy not all that you can find and a very 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 easy trading strategy and you're going to make money majority of people they losing because they don't know where to buy and they don't know how to take profit everything is too clear guys here now let's go into our indicators what the same for picture to be more clear to you our indicator guys as you see it pause here we are in an extreme overbought should we sell not yet my friend there is no price action indicating us we need to enter short we need to wait in till now there is nothing yet guys yes protect yourself sell a little bit live a little bit of profit even if it fall down to zero you will not lose nothing because you are in profit and if it continues going upward you make more profit my friend and here the good news guys because we are here in the control of the bulls there is no bears yet in the market and we will see when the fed interest rate decision came how it's going to change because me i'm still believing the interest rate decision is going to change the market direction everything is too clear guys now let's go into see our other indicator what it's saying for pictures to be more clear to you that one here guys as you see it we've been here at the overbought area all along that's what i told you those ones they are just indicators guys you don't need to base your trading about them you need to base your trading because of the price action the price action we got here is that op channel here as you see it that the only price action you have now if it came and breaking down here yes you can enter short but if it doesn't break there is no entry short yet also we're still in a very very sharp uptrend my friend and what me i told you here about that place here i've been explaining that thousands of times what me i told you i told you you got here a very stronger supply and demand zone and we are in it now here if we came back inside here 100 percent that one is the bottom guys that's why me i told you don't sell everything and why me i told you you need to take it off the money you invest in the start because it's much from here you're going to see it falling down again and it's going to give you another load in that one so you, you free the cash and you take some profit and that free cash when it's falling down more you're going to buy more if it continues going upward i'm going to show you where we're going to buy again everything is very simple guys everything is very simple just some people they never ever trade they came and they misleading you and they give you information which is not right everything is too clear guys i was going to 30 minutes to see if there is any scalping opportunity for today so it's going there here we are in 30 minutes people they've been with us as we enter from here down here because of a, a cup and handle guys it came the bitcoin here i told you the same thing protect yourself it went up till here in the last video we used to be here in that place here i told you there is no price action here indicating for us as we need to enter short now did we got any price action yes you can make like that and like that that a triangle but it's not yet it's need another wave down or up or us to know is 100 percent tell now there is nothing yet and look at the volume guys down here and down here what you see and if we came to the volume and we do it like that and we go to the chart and we do it like that what you see you got a divergence in the volume guys yes or no so there is something is going to come guys we don't know what is it but there is something is coming guys but here we don't got any price action indicating for us as we need to enter short so we need to wait in a little bit only price action you can do is that one you can do it like that as a channel or something like that so maybe if it's breaking here you can enter short guys yes or no you see it what me i do or not i make like a small channel let's see our indicators guys with the same for picture to be more clear to you that one here will be in here at the overbought area all along guys should we enter short no we need that price action me i show you here that channel here or that flag to be broken down for us to enter short tell no there is no entry yet i want to show you something else let me show it to you guys look here guys what you see look here and here what you got here guys in 30 minutes look at that one how high it is 
and here look at that one where you are you are low but the price here is going higher than that one so you got a divergence here in 30 minutes guys so i think the interest rate is going to push the bitcoin down guys that's what me i told you you need to wait in the interest rate told you enter now short no my friend you got that price action that one or that uptrend or whatever name it whatever you want it's need that one the price of the bitcoin to come and to break here for us to enter short take profit it needs to be at the 200 moving average guys everything is too clear guys so that's it for that video guys see you after the daily candle finish it bye for now guys